News of the apparent disaster was announced first on Twitter around three hours after the aircraft lost touch with air traffic control. Many other tweets from Egypt Air soon followed, then an announcement live on Egyptian television. An Egypt Air aircraft had disappeared during its flight from Paris to Cairo and had not been heard from for hours. It could be any number of things. Uh, the worst case scenario, of course, is, as we've seen in the past, uh, a, a bomb pl planted by a terrorist. Um, one of the mitigators against that theory, of course, is that this plane originated uh, in Paris, Charles de Gaulle, and uh, security in Paris, uh, particularly in more recent times, of course, is very tight. Egypt Air Flight MS804 took off from Charles de Gaulle Airport in the French capital on Wednesday night. The airline says the Airbus A320 was cruising at around 11,000 metres over the Mediterranean Sea when it disappeared off radar screens. The airliner was 16 kilometres into Egyptian airspace after flying over Greece. The Greek government has reportedly joined the search operation. It was likely over the Mediterranean because the Greek airspace uh, joins the Egyptian airspace in that area. So that's probably where they'll be looking. They should know the exact location of it. They'll know where it disappeared from radar contact. And that would be the point where you'd, you'd begin your search. Egypt Air has confirmed 56 passengers were on board, including two babies and a child, as well as seven crew members and three security officers. Now it's an anxious wait for news for their family and friends. Miriam Nahond, Al Jazeera.